example, is what we have on the table in front of us right now. It's called an Oblatin. The original Carlsbad Oblatin Neapolitan wafer assortment, which we don't get to see very often. I want you to say hi to Marie Louise Ludwig, who's going to be here for a couple of ideas for us in the show today. Hello. How are you, my dear? Wonderful. You're looking very patriotic in Thank time you. for Memorial Day. It's Memorial Day weekend. It's perfect. Ready. I love it. <laughs> um, and this particular assortment to me is very exciting because we had an original assortment that was so popular, mm -hmm. they've been nice enough to bring a couple of other flavors. So what you get are three separate tins, 90 pieces, like nine zero, 90 pieces in each one of the three tins. And in each tin, the first flavor is the original, which is your vanilla almond. Your second one is your chocolate. And your third one is your strawberry flavor. So M44138, $54.32. This truly is snacking at its most unique. So, Marie Louise, could you explain the factory that this comes from? Because really only one place does this. You know what? This goes back to the 1300s. And I love the fact that you can remember the kings and the queens who would go to the former Czechoslovakia, to the Carlsbad spas, and they would have these dessert wedges, so like gourmet dessert wedges. So there's one place in Minnesota, one mm -hmm. little factory that still makes these with exactly the same molds and exactly the same recipes that the royalty was eating back in the 1300s. Wow. So these are poured onto the molds and they're all touched. Everyone's touched by hand. So these are still handmade. They're all beautifully embossed the way they used to be. They're loaded with this light confection. It's powdered sugar, mm -hmm. unsalted butter, and ground almonds. Together with those crispy, crunchy, light wafers makes an unbelievable wedge. They're all cut into individual pieces and they're put into these special tins, which by the way, are made especially for QVC, these nice big tins. Really? You get 270 of these crispy, delightful little wafers to try, and you can have seven of these. This is what the okay. inside of them looks it, like. The math seven. is really cool on this. Seven, <laughs> and what does seven equal? 60 calories. Which that's is crazy. two points if you're in the program that's counting that. They're low in carbs, they're low in calories, they're low mm. in cholesterol, but the thing is, Sharon, they taste delicious. They are so, they're so good. <laughs> crispy. There is nothing like this. I mean, look at how literally wafer thin this is. It's hard for you to imagine until you experience it for the first time how crisp it is. So if you really have that hankering for, you know, the chips or something like that, this is so delicious and it's just a whisper of sweet. It's not super sweet, it's just enough. So you can add this to other desserts and do other things, but I love that you can just not on these all day because the first one is the vanilla almond. That's the original. Yep, that, that's right. So you're getting the vanilla almond and the strawberry mm -hmm. and the chocolate, like Neapolitan ice cream would be. In fact, if you go to some of the higher end hotels mm -hmm. where you get that really nice big um, ball of, of um, ice cream, you'll find these gourmet dessert wafers sticking into the top of them. And they look amazing. They do. And they have the printing. You can actually see the printing on the wafers. It's just, it's amazing. You are totally getting to taste a piece of history here. And they're gourmet and they're artisan. And there's so many different things you can do for them for the summertime sweet and savory because you can use them as a base for something like your fig jam and your candy mm. pecans and maybe some kind of gourmet meat on the top of them. Beautiful. You can do them with mousses. You can use them as your little, as your scoop for your dips. Mix them with ice cream. We've done them down here with uh, a little bit of port wine cheese and some oh bacon gosh. and an apple on here. You know what? That's the beauty of this is mm -hmm. this could be supremely elevated and fancy and and gourmet if you want them to be but at the same time if you're just looking for a good unique snack just for you that you don't want to share with anybody else that's perfectly fine too i was just taking a bite out of the strawberry and you get just this little burst mm -hmm. like it's it's mm -hmm. small and that's what i love about this is that there's such a subtlety to this snack a subtlety to the crispiness and there's a subtlety to the sweetness and in this case that fruit flavor and then we've also got the chocolate that i'm dying to try you're getting a total of two 170 pieces between the three tins that you'll see sort of laid out. So if you're gonna have a gathering and people are coming All over to your house, mm -hmm. one tin would go a really long way. And by the way, how many have been ordered today? Okay, already today, 500 of these have been spoken for. So if you'd like to experience what an Oblaten is all about and go back to the 1300s, mm -hmm. what food do we have 
really that's a that's like this that isn't just meat that's been around like since I the know, 1300s. I love that. And you know, the gentleman that brought these over from the former Czechoslovakia brought the recipe over started making these in Minnesota in his basement. Oh my god! And they became so popular that he took them to the Minnesota State Fair, and mm -hmm. they became hugely popular at the Minnesota State Fair. But the thing is, mm -hmm. it's just one small factory that makes these. These are right. not something you can find everywhere. So it gives everybody the opportunity to really taste a piece of history, and we're so glad we could bring them to QVC. I don't know that I've ever had the chocolate one. Because try. This, I know, because <laughs> this is this is an assortment that I've hardly ever seen. I saw it on with somebody else once, but this is this is really unique to me because the color on this one is mm -hmm. richer too. Mm -hmm. And can I tell you, mm -hmm. if you eat a whole tin, it's 720 calories. There's still room for a few extra for the, for whole the day. Tin? And you can do it. The first time I saw these, honestly, I'm like, oh, really? And then I got going on them. And now they really are kind of like my go-to snack. When I want something light with a little pop of sweetness, mm -hmm. with flavor, and That's I right. just want a little something something, these are perfect. And you know what? You get all three of these tins for $54.32, and your shipping is included in that price. So it is delivered to your door for that value. So if you're really wanting to try this and see and experience what it's all about, it is about supreme crispiness. Because like you said, I mean, mm -hmm. the first time that I had had a chance to sample, you were nice enough to give me a sample of the tin. And I brought it home, and I like to test things out of my family and see what they think. The kids were already in bed by the time I got home, so I sat down and I just opened the tin and I was sitting in front of the TV. Stop eating them. <laughs> and I just ate and I went, oh, oh, that's really good. I think and I'll then have I another. picked up another one. I know I ate more than seven, <laughs> but I didn't feel guilty about it when I actually broke down the numbers and that seven, how many calories does seven have? 60. 60 calories Seriously, in here. Just 60 calories for, for seven of them. I mean, most of the things that you eat out and about, like it would be, 120 calories for one of something and this is seven of something for 60 calories and these are still made the old-fashioned way so when you stop and think about it what's on the inside powdered sugar unsalted butter mm -hmm. and ground almonds on the middle and you can taste that you can taste the butter you can taste the creaminess you of the powdered can. sugar but just in a really light delicate mm -hmm. way and that's what it. it is when you bite into it you get that crisp first, but then the butter, once it hits your tongue, that's where that little whisper of the creaminess mm -hmm. has come from. And then the sugar, that sweetness, there's almost like this poof that kind of happens when the sugar hits your tongue, but it's all very subtle. It's very beautiful, but the one thing that will leave you feeling satisfied is the crunch that these have yeah. when you're eating them. So three individual tins. So you know what this says to me? It says, great snack, leave it in the pantry. But if you're going to someone's house or you've got all these holidays coming up or you know everyone gets together in the summertime, not everybody drinks wine and certainly the kids aren't drinking the wine. So this is something to give as a gift to that family that everybody can enjoy. And 44138, so your flavors are the original vanilla almond that you see in the front. Here is your strawberry. This one is your chocolate right here. Stay on the lines, your shipping and handling is included. Marie Louise isn't going anywhere because you're gonna be back for something brand new mm -hmm. from Corazonas. Mm -hmm. And we're very excited. So I'm not hugging you yet, because I'll have the chance to hug <laughs> you.